Before he became a superstar game designer, Hideo Kojima was a university student studying economics, but it was during his time in college when he discovered the Famicom, and it was love at first sight. He announced to his professors and colleagues that he intended to pursue a career in video games, and although they pleaded with him to reconsider, he already made up his mind. Kojima joined Konami in 1986. Kojima was brought on board as a designer, but due to his lack of familiarity with the programming, his first game was cancelled outright and he was tormented by his colleagues for his failures. He was given one last chance and was handed the reins of Metal Gear. Konami asked him to create a war game, but Kojima instead wanted to design a game predicated on stealth rather than action. It was a tough sell, but after three months of development, the new breed of stealth action gameplay wowed playtesters, and Konami finally realized Metal Gear's potential. Metal Gear released in 1987 to the MSX system to critical acclaim. The very next year, Metal Gear made its way to the shores of North America on the NES, where it sold more than a million copies. Konami quickly ordered a sequel, Snake's Revenge, but Kojima never worked on it, and it was considered a dud. Metal Gear did eventually receive a proper sequel, but it wasn't until during the PlayStation era that Kojima, with artist Yoji Shinkawa, catapulted the franchise to staggering success with the release of Metal Gear Solid. Ah, kept you waiting, huh? Have fun!